This is a tutorial for Dext Science Set 4.1. Hi, in this tutorial, we will investigate the separation of immiscible liquids like cooking oil and water using an improvised separating funnel. Let's open up our sets. This is the new packaging for the DEST 4.1 set. So these two compartments are for the separation of liquid um, activities and we have this compartment for cycles, that is the simple pendulum and the Newton's cradle. So in this experiment, we'll use these two compartments, that is B4.1.2.2, is the same here. Now let's look at the items we use for these activities. So now we have our wood and our rod, that will make up our retort stand. We realize that there's a bit change here. So we'll connect our rod to the, to the plastic piece here. So you could see the thread on the rod, you connect it to where we've made the hole. Then you turn it clockwise. Make sure you turn it gently and it's perpendicular to the board. Make sure it's as straight as possible. You put it on your table. Do it so you don't see the thread on the rod anymore. Okay, so this is okay. Yeah, so make sure that the bend is facing the same direction as the board. And it's perpendicular to your board. This is how it should look like. Now let's take the plastic piece that will make up the clamp for the separating funnel. When you check this side, you will see a hole there. We'll connect it to the rod of a rod stand so you connect it this way and try wobbling it so that it fits perfectly it should go all the way so connect it like this Now let's move on to the separating funnel. So let's take our items to make the separating funnel. We have our barrel, we have our improvised tap, and we have the silicone tube. So we'll start with our improvised tap. So you turn this anti-clockwise and remove one of the plastic pieces so one is a spare so you have to remove one from it connect your improvised separating funnel to the retro stand this way first we would have to test for leakages so what we'll do is to pour some water here and try and tighten the tap To test this, pour a little water into your improvised separating funnel and check if it's leaking. So since this is leaking, I'll try and close the tap. So turn it clockwise to close it completely. Do it gently so that you don't break the plastic piece. I'm pouring more water to check, it's still leaking, so I'll continue to tighten it. As you can see, it's not leaking anymore, so the setup is complete. To so make sure you place an empty beaker under your setup. Now let's move on to this mixing of the liquids. So we have 
the water and we have the oil so we'll pour a bit of the oil the more you mix the longer it will take for your mixture to separate so after mixing the liquid you pour it into your separating funnel pour it gently and make sure it doesn't spill now that we've poured it let's wait for about 15 minutes for the liquid to separate completely you could already see that the water which is the heavier liquid has gone to the base and the oil which is light is up it will take a while for it to separate completely After 15 minutes of waiting, you could see that there's no trace of oil in the water. So let's open a tap gently till the water starts dripping. You don't want to open it too much because you might get some of the oil into the water. So let's wait a while for the water to drip. You see the oil coming down bit by bit. When the oil gets close to the tap, you close the tap quickly and gently to prevent the oil from getting into the beaker that has the water. So now we've been able to separate the two liquids successfully. As you can see, there's no trace of oil in the water. Now we'll pour out the oil from the separating funnel. So we'll take it out and we'll pour it into an empty container like this. So you can see that the water and the oil have been separated completely. Once again, this is an activity from the Desk Science Set 4.1.